Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. First of all I want to wish all of you guys a happy new year. I hope 2020 will be a year full of good things for all of you. Anyway, for today's video I decided to make my 2020 K-pop predictions. These are things I think will happen this year so yup. Enjoy the video. In 2019, TWICE had a very successful and interesting year. I think in 2020, they will stick with the more elegant concept like feel special and kinda leave the cute style. They will still have b-sides that are more cute but they will only promote more mature songs. A thing a lot of onces are also curious about is Mina. I am sure she will come back stronger than ever for TWICE next promotion. My prediction and my hope is that all the TWICE members will be healthy and safe in 2020 and they will get a vacation. <laughs> this is a popular unpopular opinion but yeah I am one of those who think that Blackpink will for sure leave YG. I think they will leave in like March or April and we will get so much content and I am just so ready for this. I think as soon as they get out of the dungeon they will be so active, they will drop the full album, promote it really well and even more. YG will be saved by Treasure 13. They will finally debut and their debut will be super successful. They will be very popular in Korea and kinda clear the name of the company a little. SM will also debut their new girl group. They will have a solid debut but they won't be super popular before their second or third comeback. <laughs> Okay so as a carrot I have to talk about Seventeen of course. They are currently on their O2 world tour and they have been so busy in 2019 that's why I don't think they will make their comeback early this year. It might be around May or something. I feel like they will drop a mini album and the title track will be a sexy concept. I know Fear was pretty hot and Seventeen don't do the same concept two times in a row that's why I believe it will be brighter. Sexy and bright I don't know if you guys get what I mean but yeah. Sexy bright lol. Anyway it will be a banger and they will beat many of their previous records. <laughs> Yes, so I think ITZY will keep doing their thing. They won't change their concept. They did so well last year and if I was JIP I wouldn't change a thing either. They are so young and their concept really suit them. Now what I think will happen is that it will be a little bit darker. I feel like ITZY rap line will shine this year and I can't wait to see it. So BTS last OT7 comeback before Jenning list will be super epic. Boy with Love and Idol were fun and all but I think it's time for another explosive track as the title track. The song will be so huge and I am so ready for it, the album will be their best ever and they will once again break the internet. <laughs> Mamamoo will be the top girl group of 2020. I feel like this makes so much sense. Their popularity have been increasing in the past few year and I feel like next year will be the pick of their career. Their first comeback of 2020 will go viral and will be a huge hit in Korea. They might even win a dz- <laughs> My girl Hanapia will dominate the K-pop scene this year. They will make three comebacks. They will stick to the girl crush concept but I feel like there will be a twist but I don't know lol. They will get their own variety show and they will gain a lot more fans. 
They will also perform overseas for different events. They will be successful and win two rookie awards. So this year, I have a feeling that many groups will step outside of their comfort zone. We will have a lot of oh my god moments when groups will make their comebacks because we will see a lot of new things. Very original songs, experimental songs, interesting concepts and all. Some of the groups I think will experiment with their music in 2020 are GOT7, Red Velvet, Stray Kids, Luna, 17, CLC and X1. <laughs> So I think Super M next comeback will be a huge hit. The way everyone had mixed feelings about Jopping and Doll, I feel like SM watched us and they took notes. I think the song will be super popular around the world, it will blow up on TikTok and everyone will do the choreo. It will be more simple than Jopping but still very epic. I'm proud of you, 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 I'm pro